All right, what is up, and welcome to K Plus Gaming Corner. We are here with some more Cyberpunk 2077 Phantom Liberty. So I'm switching up things a little bit this time, right? So I've had basically my one character that I've been running through this playthrough so far. Switching to my other character, this is actually my main original character. Playing this a little bit different to explain what I'm talking about. So this character has only six intelligence. My other character is pretty much maxed out. I still have the technical ability, but this time we have 16 reflexes, 14 body, and uh, 18 cool. So switching up things uh, a little bit there. In terms of how I'm running things, this character is pretty much maxed out uh, in terms of, well, I got the three capstones where it comes to the technical abilities and similar to my other character we kind of had some of these same perk points a little bit more involved this time and then we got the the bolt going with our our tech weapon which right now i'm using a tech shotgun but i'm also using a smart weapon too so um yeah we got that going and then in terms of you know a little bit more cool this time movement speed we're using, and I'll get into the cyberware why, but yeah, cool is a little bit better with this character. I'm not doing all the hacking and all that kind of stuff I was doing before. We're doing the Sandivistan this time, so we're slowing time. Uh, we can also slow time while we're driving. Uh, extra movement speed while we're crouching around. Uh, reflexes, I'm uh, working on getting nice with the blades and all that, doing the dashing and the dash speed and all that kind of stuff We've got that going but yeah that's pretty much uh, like i said i'm running a different character this time in terms of the cyberware it's uh slightly different so it's pretty much the same thing though other than obviously the sand of Easton. and we still got the blood pump or not the blood, blood the second heart um but instead of the blood pump we're doing the what is it the threat of vac or whatever this is we're getting some extra movement speed when our health is low and we have um, extra health anytime we neutralize an enemy. And then, let me see, we got the Adreno trigger, we have atomic sensors, all these things are really helpful. Uh, bionic joints, so we're getting some extra armor. And um, yeah, and I'm still doing the mono wire this time. This character, I'm using the electrifying one. But for the most part, that's pretty much how I'm running things. We'll see how it goes. Shout out to the smart weapons. Alright. Um the health. Dude. I don't like where you're at. We're almost home now. I see some people approaching from below. I'm empty. Need to reload. I'm not very happy with it. A little more effort. Not looking good. Listen, man. Uh, that did not go where I wanted to. Let's go. Okay. All right. I'm coming. I'm coming.
like I said, I want to find. Oh yeah, I could probably activating defense systems. Forty percent. Duck around these walls. Two seconds. All right. Thing is down to fifteen percent. Thing. It's down to 15%. I don't even know where, it, where it's at. Which one of these? There's like too many of these things. Is that the one? That's the one I, I need, right? Got him. Got him. Give me that. Hell yeah. Got a new weapon. Hey, hey. Careful with that. I've been looking I'm all over for you. Runner. See? The fuck? Don't want him to catch a ricochet. Huh? 